Hi YouTube, this is Rose, and I'm making this video to read this. This is really important, church. We all need to um, pay attention to this. A post that Laura Lee Dykstra posted on her Facebook an hour ago. I'm going to tell a story on me now. God will give me a warm-up. It was quite a few years ago that the Holy Ghost told me to pray an anthema over Tiller the Killer. God wanted that man anthemized. Well, I prayed and I prayed and I prayed, and then I got released. I got a release. I prayed through. Well, my heart goes out to Scott Roder because if I'd been working out, the salvation in me at the time wouldn't have taken no human hands. I don't really understand that part, but you'd better believe I sang and danced and shouted praise to Jesus when I heard that man's brains got splattered over the church pew. Judgment begins at the house of the Lord. God has wrath in judgment. I ain't playing. I just told God I was sorry that I wasn't practiced enough to get the job done with no human hands. Full angelic is better. I prayed God no one fool me with a false flag. I pray that was the real deal there. I ain't come to play church. So I guess what she's saying is um, a human person took this man's life. But um, had she been more focused, it would have been in an angelic manner. Okay. Now, I'm not going to read this whole thing, but I do want to come over here. She talks about birthing and glory. The walk, when she, glory will fill the house, the room, whatever. People will get healed when she does her meetings. I'm usually, I, I usually am kind of ticked off, really. That's not hard to believe. And I refuse to let the mantle come upon me, refuse to pour out the spirit, but I decided to begin to birth. I will let the manifestation of glory rise because, well, I want God to judge the people and strike them dead before me because they gave me a hard time. And God said he would. So I'm letting manifest power on me. And Michael has come. I'm telling you, people just don't want to let me be me. They just want me to pretend like I'm just a regular pre- apocalyptic Christian lately or something and well lol they don't think I should think or feel or operate like an ap apocalyptic apostle but I am and I'm going to let Michael cut some folk down lol I will so I guess she has the control to let the angel Michael stomp on whom she comes against her who, because they gave her a hard time they will be struck dead so I ask the church to pray together in unity against this person and against their praying praying death let's pray together in one accord and in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth tonight or today whatever the case may be for you Thank you for your time. Bye.